same kind of scams that you might face as a UK student. If you know all the scams, then you don't have to worry. So the first one, it's a car accident scam. When you hear this kind of thing, you just hang up. You don't have to talk to them because this is a scam. The second, you just want a lottery. Number three, you just want a phone. Number four. Very Some frauds may call you and talk like as they are from your bank. You may ask for your account details or your card details or your PIN number. So never share anything like this. Number five is the computer repair scam. They might sound like they're from a well-known IT firm and they might talk to you like that. They might say you, you have virus in your computer but never believe them. They're just scammers. Number six. If someone calls you and asks you to pay tax then you don't have to pay tax because you are a student here and students in uk they don't have to pay tax number seven when you will come here in uk you will receive so many calls that you have got a job offer when you ask about the salary they say that it's not a paid job and don't go for it because these are like commission based job and these are not frauds or scams but this is not a good way to earn money here because people use other people in the name of commission jobs so don't go for these things there are really better jobs out there you just have to look for it number eight so this is a very interesting one the role is mystery shopper for example they are gonna send you to a phone shop and they're gonna ask you to see the shop environment talk to the salesperson and then buy a phone and then get out of it start working and then they will come and pick the phone from you that is completely a fraud don't go for these kind of scams because they might sound like they are testing you or this is a part of the recruitment process but this cannot be a part of the recruitment process come on this is like really silly never go for this kind of thing because i have seen people going for this kind of job offer never do that number nine might look like that if you just click the link then you're gonna get a reward don't click anything which you watch online because if you click then um, they're gonna ask you some really general stuff which is like your name first name your surname your birth they don't give your birthday anywhere it's a very important thing sometimes you don't understand that giving a birthday date it's not gonna make much difference but which is actually a lie because this is something very important and people can guess your password people can do a lot of things with your birth date so don't give that so don't fill up a form online if you know that person very well then go for it the last one and the most important one this is not about london only it's about anywhere wherever you are watching this video from it can happen to you there as well never share your passport uh, the scan copy of your passport you feel like the person is suspicious never share your passport scan copy with them because with this kind of things like documents passport or driving license or your brp which is means biometric residence permit this kind of things they can use to hack your social media account so this is not good never share because um, these are the things which you will need when suppose your account is hacked so then you will provide these documents and this is how they're gonna check that you are a authentic person and this account belongs to you so if you give these personal details out to someone or to a fraud then it's easy for them to hack your account and then take control over it so don't do it thank you so much i hope this video is going to be informative for you because when i came here um, honestly i had to go through all of these phases obviously i didn't believe i didn't fall for it so you should not also so that's why i'm just trying to help you out and i'll be talking about all other stuff in another videos which i'm gonna make in future but till now if you like the video then please do subscribe and share with your friends and i am very close to 1000 subscribers so i need your help i need you to subscribe my channel and i'll be very happy if you do it and please comment because i'm gonna reply and i love talking to people so i would be very happy to communicate directly with you guys and if you guys have any suggestion what kind of videos i should make more more. Um, if I can help the international students out who are about to come to UK then let me know because I'm gonna make a lot of videos on this international student topic. Bye bye take care